So one of the many things uh, you got to do when you're thinning, and most people know this, a lot of some, it's surprising to me how many operators thin and don't even know how to use a prism. Just check your basal area. Uh, after you get a, as you can see, we're starting a new track. It's really thick over there. It's really thick over there. This is the first full middle I've gotten completed. I usually like to jump down and, uh, you know, check my basal area and make sure I'm, my, my tree selection is where it's supposed to be. And this is a prism. As you can see, the camera will focus. It is wedge shaped. And what you do is you hold it up. And it's going to show that tree. It's going to show the glass better than it shows the tree, but you can get the idea. You look through the glass, it's just like looking through a pencil, a pencil in a glass of water. You can see the tree inside the glass is offset from the tree that is standing outside. Trying to back it up a little bit. And so long as those two pieces of tree that you can see, the tree in the glass and the tree standing outside of the glass are touching, such as you see there, you count that as a one. And in my area, we thin to a 70 basal area. So you would want to put the prism in one spot Usually I pick a stump like so and you try and get this. I know it's not 100% perfect for the foresters that are watching this, but basically, get this to focus back there. there we go. So that's a one. That tree over there. Just barely touching. My forester will count that as a half. So there's a half, and then that one's not touching. So there's two and a half, three and a half, four and a half. tree over there is too far six and a half and it's hard to see on here my forester would probably count that as another half so that's a uh, right here you can see the, the tops where they're evenly spaced and everything so that's a crash course in uh, prism uh, plot taking and now, if I was actually taking taking plots, I would take off walking and step. Uh, usually, I step like 30 paces, 30 steps, 30 big steps, and just in any general direction. And whenever I get, whether I'm standing in a down row or in the middle or on the edge, I stop and I, I take my my plot. And uh, basically, you just you take five, six, seven plots add everything together and get your average and uh you know whatever your divided total comes out to is is your your basal area that you're running in your thinning like i said my stuff we we shoot for a 70. uh some of the older thinnings that we get into they let us thin it down to like a 60 and they just skip the second thinning portion of it but so that's a crash course in forestry <laughs> some forestry 101 thinning 101 there we go thinning 101 uh, hopefully y'all enjoyed that